Hi, <laughs> so we are live with some Warframe on YouTube, on YouTube Gaming, that's amazing, I really have been enjoying uh, streaming to YouTube lately, so that's really cool, and we got sound, yeah, just a minute. Uh, right now I can't really see who's uh, lurking in the channel because I haven't set that up yet so well, yeah my phone is going off <laughs> anyway I'm gonna I think I'll start with some uh, alerts this time yeah defense that's nice Need to make sure my microphone is muted. Oh, yeah. You don't see my roof, I guess. <laughs> That's no point. But, oh, it's been such a long time since I played Lost, so my sensitivity is totally off. Um, notice. What are we supposed to defend here? Uh, My ability is flash dash. <laughs> so when I'm full of energy, I can jump between enemies and actually kill them with my sword. And that really is a lot of fun. So I was in Warframe earlier today and modded my rifle and it seems to be working really great I put on 100% uh, crit damage a lot of puncture and I think 40% impact so it's a beast <laughs> Thank you. 
if I can only hit. Oh, I didn't see you there. So whenever uh, the health uh, impact shows yellow, it means that it's a quick drop. And on a quick shot, it does 1150 damage, which is totally crazy. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that. I keep shooting uh, double shots. And even on enemies that dies, so I don't know why I keep doing that. <laughs> I don't need to. Ah, move. Flashing between enemies now. That's weird. Yeah, this is going well for us. didn't die <laughs> also sure he died but yeah not today I'm just gonna I can't get that yeah okay no there's uh, a trick when you do slide on the you do a double jump and the slide again you can really move quickly if you ever played the <laughs> Warframe or watched Warframe streams before, you know that already. But that's the way to do it on the PlayStation, at least. Oh, Blunder was sweet. That's a pretty decent mod. Check for some loot. There's nothing here. Wow. A parity mod had so many of those already. Oh, this game is so much fun. It's crazy. I mean, the gameplay is awesome. I, I don't like the person shooters. Not at all. I hate the person shooters. But Warframe, the mobility, everything, the gameplay, everything is so amazing. So I don't mind it at all in Warframe. I've been here already. <laughs> Pressure point is a really good mod. mod. 
you can upgrade those to max. This one was 20%, so 20 times 2 is. No, 20. <laughs> 20 times 5 is 100. So. Did I say no? Yeah. I got brain freeze. <laughs> so we focused here, so I don't really notice what I'm saying. Okay, so there was one left in here. I can make that jump. <laughs> Total misuse of uh, perfectly good ability. What's up with those planes? What, what class is that? Yeah, let's do the dual pistols for a little while. And, uh, <laughs> those are not as powerful as the rifle, that's for sure. They are fun too. Oops, we need to stop up there. Yeah, there's no damage done on that one at all. So we are at uh, wave 7, I think. So I'm playing Excalibur and uh, he's my favorite actually of the ones I've tried. I've tried like four different, four or five, I'm not sure. Uh, he's maxed out right now. But it's a, it's a really fun class to play. It's kind of, I guess it's a melee class really, but he can do everything. And he has really good health and uh, armor. Oh, I'm on fire. <laughs> Need to charge my control. Listen to play this mutant defense 
to still get mods. Oh, come on. And that's at least the only reason I play. Farm mods and sometimes endos, stuff like that. Plug in the charger. Hopefully. I think there's another Excalibur here as well. It sounds like it. Just shooting random. I <laughs> took down all my armor. Oh, shit. Stuff is happening here now. <laughs> I changed my ability to. <laughs> The extraction team will take over from here. Time to evacuate. I got a lot of months. Cool. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if there's any more alerts we can do. That's invasions. Those can be pretty hard and pretty long. Just join it. Okay. What the what? Let's do a void fish then. Exterminate. Sabotage. Survival. Now that's locked actually. All of these are locked for me, except this one. So let's do that one. So, these are relics. In order to play for... Uh, in that mission you need to... Operator, I've run diagnostic about. progressions. All okay. systems nominal. Shut up. You don't need to thank me. <laughs> you need to equip a relic. And the relic... 
Well, these are uh, rewards you might get after after you played, and uh, I'm actually looking for Paris, but I think I have Paris Prime Sting string. Paris no. Just Paris, Paris, two commas. I got. I actually need f Fang Prime Blade. Slim. This one. <laughs> Might be a no a hard one. We'll see. The level was pretty low, so it's not, I'm not sure. That webcam always keeps moving for me. <laughs> yeah. I'm supposed to use glasses all the time, but. When I'm playing for hours, I yeah, it doesn't work for me. Eliminate all corpus threats. There are void fissures in the area. Use these to crack open the relic. We're near a fissure. They're dropping reactant. Use it to crack open the relic. Keep fighting. Look for more reactant. They spotted you. What? <laughs> Oh, I don't like those robots. Do do do. So there's nothing uh, around there. Guess I need to go down. Though. What's over here? A reactant. Uh, I need to collect all ten. So, Let's see. Can I get up there? No. Like that. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. So this game is getting a huge, huge update soon. It's gonna be totally crazy that update. But oh, thought this is <laughs> it will go down. It's actually like a new game actually, they could have called it Warframe 2. It's uh, it's gonna be open world, totally open world. And it's gonna be totally crazy because of <laughs> huge monsters and stuff you need to watch out for, so... How the hell do I get it out of here? 
So yeah, keep your eye out for that one. It's gonna be amazing, I think. You can actually go on Twitch and uh, watch their official channel. And there's a stream there. We've been locked out. Let's override the security. Oh. Breach That's complete. We're afraid to proceed. <laughs> Didn't really see that uh, last one there. Eh? Yeah, that's gotta be like that. No, it's not like that. Alarms reset. You have broken their ranks and they are on the run. Another successful mission. Find extraction. Come on, jump up, jump, jump, jump there, jump there. So I have a mod now, so it picks up everything within 5.6 meters or something like that, 6.5 or whatever it is. So it picks up mods and everything. Oh, a limb, Paris. So we actually got a Paris stuff here. Paris Prime Blueprint. Oh. I don't think I have the <laughs> prime blueprint, so... Wow, that's really nice. Wow, okay, wow, wow, wow. But that's gonna be a lot of... Farming. <laughs> yeah, so we got some good shit. was some thing that got upgraded capacity 22 oh. I missed it what it was that got upgraded so I have no clue Okay, so I can't do it yet, or I need to defeat the sergeant at Iliad on Phobos. Uh, I, <laughs> I don't have Phobos unlocked yet, I think. I need some... What is this called? Yeah. Let's go to Mars, yeah. Cephalon fragments. I need to find. Stand by while I analyze the intelligence I profile. I think it's one radio. more cephalon. Error, yeah. not a number. Did the operator enjoy this criticism? 
ammunition supply. Some of those. Might get lucky and find the last fragment. Oh, so I didn't. F what? <laughs> oh, there was some. It's already gone in this mission. Yeah, so I'm gonna look around for a cephalon fragment. And that can be, be pretty much everywhere, so. And I don't, <laughs> I don't think a defense mission is the best way to find one. I don't even know if you can find one in defense. Can actually. Where is he? <laughs> Come on! Okay, maybe not then. Not today. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> nice place to come and attack. can carry a lot of ammo right now. Wow. That's cool. sometimes
I don't know. I don't need a relic, really. Continue to defend. You will be rewarded for okay, your bravery. Okay, I'm gonna do it alone now, I think. And there's a host migration, so... Yeah. The enemy is at our doorstep. We must defend our equipment until reinforcements arrive. I missed every shot there. Oh, no. Oh, they are tearing through my armor. That's crazy here now. <laughs> I need to be a bit more careful. And the pot is getting. These guys were powerful when you're only one person. What was that? Oh, energy. My sweet ability. Seeing through doors again. That thing is uh, a little buggy sometimes. I'll make it, I think. I think it will be okay. They only stop with those grenades, I would be okay. Uh, no, I'm not sure, actually. There's so much grenade shit going on here that I'm kind of crazy, actually. Yeah, it's gonna be destroyed. Sixty-one health. <laughs> Sixty-three. Come on, heal. Heal up. Heal up. You too. Heal. 
Oh no, it's gonna be done for now. If I'm lucky, I can see where the first wave comes from. Sometimes they come from the exact same place, which <laughs> is really helpful in situations like this. Beautiful too, so don't kill me. Ah, oh, that's so hard. do that from all the way over there Austin oh my aim is totally terrible here <laughs> Ooh, he did, he did die Might be that it's yeah pretty close so I guess. <sighs> Look at my pod. It's in a terrible state. What? What can we do about that? Beautiful pod. Oh, I'm almost dead here. This gun doesn't take long before I die. That's a nice headshot on that thing. This can be a bit hard to do. I'm extremely happy about my mobbing on my primary rifle. Well, on everything actually. standing up there or I wanna come down and fight like a man. Extract. 
We're done here. The extraction team will take over from here. Time to evacuate. Yeah, we got a few mods on this, and we got some endos. <laughs> so I'm gonna check if there's something I can build now. Yeah, there is. Mm. Vault. Bust chassis. <laughs> Ten times Vapor Spectre Fragger Brock skin. Oh, yeah. This might be a really cool weapon. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know those weapons. So. Rhino. I would like to build Rhino. Cernos. That's actually the bow I'm tr trying to get. And Paris Prime, of course. But what am I missing there? Okay, plastids. Yeah, that's a typical problem for me. Cernos. Do I have Cernos? If I do, there's no point building it. Mm. Do you remember the old war, Operator? Order so seems to have misplaced those memories. Okay, so the weapons are, that are re really easy to get and that I really recommend. I don't know much about Warframe, but the weapons that, in my experience, are worth getting as fo soon as possible is this one, the Garakata. And yeah, this one is hard to get, I guess. And this one, Voltor. That's a really excellent weapon. You can actually bolt the enemy to <laughs> straight into the wall. Uh, Attica. I'm not sure that's so easy to get. I don't remember. I got it early, but I don't, I'm not sure. And Paris, of course. And that's one other as well. Yeah, Latro. So these are the weapons I would get as soon as possible, but I really love the Cyberis Prime. Such an excellent weapon. And as you see, I can randomize it to be any look any way I want. Or I can actually go in and do the editing myself. Oops. So let's say I want. Let's go back and go An to unexpected color this one. combination, so you can operator. See. My sensors are bleeding. Differences. Pleased. So let's see. I want it to look golden. Yeah, maybe that one. That's more orange. Yeah, this one is pretty golden, right? And I want the accents to look more like me. My primary color is grey. Yeah, I think that's a match actually. 
and you, you have the secondary tests, you're not gonna see any difference. Not really. But I'm gonna do that in that volcanic, volcanic orangey color I got on my suit. On my frame, not suit. Mm -hmm. And I'm actually not happy about the color, this color. No, sorry. kind of cool actually and yeah, that's pretty nice so let's make the primary the same primary as my frame oh that was actually cool Color. So awesome. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe I should go a bit darker on this one. Oops. There's a reason why they call it fashion frame. <laughs> In the developer, <laughs> developers calls it fashion frame. I think this is really cool and that's also one of the things I love about uh, Warframe you can pretty much make uh, your frame to look wa like whatever you want I find that uh, <laughs> truly amazing so Excellent armaments. Operator. Looks like a pretty Please return covered in badass. blood. Safe and sound. Well, we need to do some kind of mission on Mars to get that cephalon fragment. Do, do, do. Isn't that our, I think, can't you?
so thirsty. Tenno, there's a time limited mission alert available. Check navigation. That's a Mercury. Mer Mercury? Kind of fun. <laughs> you like. Find the captive as soon as you can. We don't have much time. Good jump, I hope. Who you fast? You've been seen. This is a use of those. Someone called Peter. Alarms reset. Oh. the holding area. Careful. If the wardens detect you, they will surely initiate the execution sequence. The hostage is almost out of time. Hurry. He died to you fucking well? I can't have been me, I must have been someone else. We've reached the prison. Find our prisoner in one of these cells. Oh, shit. I'm so bad at this. I thought I was gonna die in there. Thank you. I'm terrible. Escort the prisoner to the extraction point, and I'll take care of the rest. Oh, I'm just moving quickly. Oh, I hate this.
We've been locked out. Let's override the security. Oh, shit. Override complete. Move on. Oh. Well. Alarm successfully hacked. The location is returning to normal security levels. Captive has been liberated. You will be rewarded for this, Tenno. Colonel Burnbrook. That's nice. Nice. And. Wow, bomb chassis? I never even heard of. Okay, Cephalon Fragment, what kind of mission? Yeah, next go ways, I will try that. See if I can find a Cephalon Fragment. I know there's two things you can't find at all. According to some people. Proceed to the dig site. See this. Oh, really attacking me? Digged into my head. Can I look for some cephalon fragments on my own, please? Can you not disturb me with? I guess not.
Yeah, that was the same work I don't be able to find any settlement agents, actually. The thing about Cephalon Fragment is that they don't pop on, up on your radar or minimap. So, <laughs> to get them, you need to actually see them. And that's really hard. But there's a couple of mods you can have. One is called Thief, and the other ones I don't really know. fragment please so I can get off this planet thing is I can't continue my quest line you know, unless I find it so and I really want to do that so yeah what's up with this room actually what's the point I'm only going around in ring here now. It feels like it. At least I'm getting some resources. That's always nice. Yeah, can't go up there. So one of those crazy rooms again. to double check hmm. yeah Salvage. Yeah, another thing I need is plastids. I need a lot of plastids. Excavator is ready to go. 
Keep it powered and protected from enemy fire. Might as well just do this then, I guess. The excavator has lost power. Find another cell. To feed it power all the time. So that's usually a two month job this excavator thing. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the deck site. So, <laughs> there's uh, too many excavations and too many Excavator enemies. Destroyed. Protect I the can't remaining dig sites. keep all of them alive. It's not possible. It's possible, of course, but it's gonna be so much work to do that. But of course, it's, if it spawns in a good place where there's like two ways to get to it instead of 15, it's possible. But <laughs> usually, that doesn't happen. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. I'm gonna stay here. Excavator right? deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Oh. She was in a hurry. What is dropping power? We need another power cell. For yeah, the I know. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying my best. getting hard to track them now. My aim isn't good enough. Looks like you just uncovered. Mm. Extraction is available if you choose. Yes. Betcha. Oh shoot. Woo! Snipers everywhere. <laughs> Brilliant. Stop sniping! We don't like snipers. <laughs> no idea how many times I'm being killed by a sniper in this game. It's gotta be a lot.
We got some good stuff up here. So tomorrow I'm gonna farm for plastids and get my builds going in the foundry. There's a lot of stuff I want to build there or whatever it's called. But if you haven't played this game yet, I really recommend it. It's one of the best games I, in my opinion, it's one of the best games. Um, it's definitely the best free to play game. There's no better, in my opinion. You, you got everything in this game. It's so crazy. And it's not a pay to win game. I know some people claim it is, but it's not. You can get every single frame, every single weapon, every single thing in this game by farming. Uh, but you can't pay for the new prime frames or frames uh, because it's exclusive to those who pay in for like a month or something I can't remember but you can uh, farm for it later there's no problem getting most of it I know people that have like 80-90% of everything that's in the game so yeah and they've gotten it by farming at least they say so I personally yeah, I think they actually paid a little as well operator I've run diagnostic there's no problems uh, All systems getting stuff so just, you don't need to thank just me. play in uh, in the beginning it's it's kind of slow Yeah, because you don't have any mods, you don't have any skills, you got one ability. But after a while, after playing for a few days, uh, let's say 40 hours, that may sound a lot, but in a game like this, that's a loot game, it's not a lot. So let's say 40 hours. After that, you can basically one shot people. Um, yeah. Or at least two shot. <laughs> Instead of uh, pumping magazines into them and nothing happening. And you can take part in a lot of uh, cool missions, stuff like that, and go from planet to planet and farm whatever you need to. Farm fra uh, make frames. Yeah, that's a no. We are crossing over to the border where that's actually more hours than forty before you can do that. But that's pretty close anyway. So, and when you play and when you play coop, it's shared. XP if you're close enough to each other so make sure you don't drift off and do a lot of stuff on your own away from people because you will actually lose XP on that I'm like a lone wolf I like to go wherever there's no other player disturbing me so when I'm out on a mission I take the other route throughout that nobody else takes <laughs> so I didn't know it was shared XP before some someone told me so <laughs> make sure you actually are close to your teammates because you earn a lot of XP by being that and I see some people comparing this game to Destiny and this is unfair to both uh, Warframe and Destiny yeah. there, there's some stuff that's 
kind of the same. Both are loot and shoot. Well, Warframe is loot and shoot melee. <laughs> it's melee or shooting is just as important in Warframe, so it's more than just loot and shoot. Uh, both games have spaceships. Oh, what the hell? So that makes this game like Destiny? No, it doesn't. Uh, Destiny is a first person shooter. The mechanics is totally different in Destiny than in uh, Warframe. It can't be compared, it really can't. And uh, as I said before, I'm a first person shooter. I like shooting stuff up in first person. I don't like third person games. But this game, I like. I like a lot. So, yeah, I don't really know a lot about Warframe, to be honest. Um, I don't know what kind of mods that are smart to have. Uh, I don't know exactly what to do with all the mods that you have. You see here, I, I got a ton of mods on this guy. Well, it's actually only 22 of 60, but yeah. And let's start here. Vitalities. I have <laughs> this one I fused into each other. Uh, so, and upgraded max to max rank so it actually gives me plus 360 percent health so i start with uh, 100 health excalibur has 100 so now i have 360 health uh, 660 of course And shield recharge, which is really useful. That's your armor. So without shield uh, recharge, I would have been dead a lot more times in the last few missions than I was than I was now. I died two times. I would have died maybe four or five. The same with redirection. <coughs> and I. It boosts my shield capacity. It's pretty obvious actually. But even though it's obvious, oh, it's a lot of things that seems to do the same, but they are different. And just barely different. And you see, here I have fast type deflection. And it's ten percent shield. Oops. And this one is fifteen percent. So obviously these two have different ranks. And that's one of the things that are so crazy in this game and hard to hard to know. And you will get a ton of duplicates. You can dismantle the duplicates and or sell them and get credits or endo for them but the mod modding system when you first understand it when you first understand all the options you got uh, it's obvious then things are just obvious it's gonna be obvious what they do and how you can upgrade them, stuff like that. So let's say I want to upgrade some for my um, rifle. Well, let's say I have a shotgun actually. So I select two of those. Okay, I go to dissolve to and I got 20 endos 
or I can go and rank them up. Oops. But then I can only select one, so. And I don't have enough endo to upgrade it a lot, but you see here, damage is a 15% plus for 15%. Now it's suddenly at 30, 45, and you can rank that up 5 times I think, so it ends up at 90%, which is pretty good actually. <laughs> and, but as I said, I don't really know a lot about that modding system, but it's a trial and error thing. And there's a lot of good videos out there explaining uh, how to do stuff. Uh, I'm gonna leave a link for one of those in the description of this video later. Tenno. But I think the person I'm thinking about is I Floyd. So I for India Floyd in one word no underscore and anything hi floyd and he has a guide that he calls warframe 2.5 guide or something like that and those videos are really long but they explain about everything you need to know about the warframe and it's pretty new as well and if you want to get entertained, uh, there's a really cool YouTuber slash streamer called Skill Up. Skill Up, in one word. Subscribe to him. He, he also knows a lot about Warframe, even though he hasn't been playing it for that long. But he's even a Warframe partner, whatever that means. So just check him out, he's, he's one of my favorite YouTubers actually. Okay, so anyway, thanks for watching and I'm actually gonna go to thw Twitch now and play some Destiny I think. So I'll be back at, on Twitch, you can see my Twitch username in the bottom of the screen. <laughs> So anyway, thanks. See you later.